And no Nathan Astle. Big blow for New Zealand. A big hole there in the top order. Sinclair, Harris, Cairns, Starris. You get the feeling they're all batting a little above where they should. Lou Vincent comes in down at six. McCullum at seven. So there's a bit of depth down that order. Mills and Adams as well. Tuffy can bat. And Bond can give the ball a bit of a tonk. So that was New Zealand today. All seam attack. And India, all seam attack as well. Nera, Zahir, Jawagal, Srinath, Ajit, Agarkar. Bangar coming in for Dinesh Mongia Tinduka still in there still to score a run in this one day international series well i tell you something that was pretty well judged by stephen fleming zaire khan first ball of his spell and it's the first runs off the bat for new zealand uh, that's a very crisp stroke played with the swing Airborne and it's out. Srinas with a safe pair of hands, and would you believe it? It's a no ball. Still got three slips. Just a little too full. They look for three. Now they'll stay with two. Well, that would have been three. No. Got him. Just a little wider. Fleming drawn into the drive on the two previous shots, went for it again, and the ball was just a couple of inches further away. From Ashish Nehra. The previous two balls were hit through mid-off. On this occasion, Fleming going to hit through extra cover. India finally break through, 26 for one. It's Harbaj and Handani, the jersey. Good shout, good shout. It's a slow ball. He's out. I think he got done in by the pace. It looks straight. Chess pitching on leg stump. Striking him in front of off. And Pahar Harper took his time and thought that ball would have hit off stump. 28 for two. Now that's the difference that Chris Cairns brings. Beautiful, he's got wonderful eyes. He's got, he generates great bat speed, and you give him wit, he'll make you pay the price for it. Oh, that is creamed over the top of extra cover. It'll be a boundary. Not if Mamma Kaif has something to do with it. But yes, I think uh, the Indian bowler's fielding needs uh, to be uh, a lot sharper than it has been. Big shot. This is a good Cairns blow. One bounce. He picks up a second boundary and races into double figures. A oh, good stroke. This time proactive. Taking his chances and picks up a good boundary. And would you believe it? After 50 balls, it's his first. Bowling. Played it on. We've seen a lot of uh, playing on in this series. Inside edge on the leg stump. That's another one out of here. And sh well, he's had a charmed life, but it had to come to an end. Going down the wicket twice positively in the over, but this time staying rooted to the crease. And then trying to work the ball to third man. Ball coming in. That's the stock delivery that uh, Srinath bowled. So that defeated uh, Matthew Sinclair's intention of running it down. and went straight through him just like he did in Wellington Srinath on fire here boy this is a big blow Cairns gone once again realising that Cairns is not moving his front foot towards the ball but leaving a big gap and you can see that the incoming delivery which is his stock delivery once again working for Javagal Srinath this and then was stopped in its tracks by the length that does uh, up the ball. This has to be a big effort. Shot. It's a little bit short from Agarka. Not too short, but short enough to get on the back foot. It's gone for four. That's well struck. It's not often that the bat has dominated the ball in this contest. And this one picked up nicely by Styrus. Back first time. Short. 
short and punished. Struggling to get there, it is struggling, and it's got there. Even though he was on the front foot, he had ample time to put this away. Pulling this time, good shot. A very good shot through mid-wicket for four. Ends the over, disappointing end for Bangar, it's 91 for four. It's a very good shot. Lou Vincent into the action this time. Bangar now into his third over. Doesn't want to bowl too many short and wide like that. Will run hard for three here. Won't take it. Steady bit of fielding down on the boundary. Because all he's doing is he's allowing Styris to rock onto the back foot and smash it away. And that will go all the way. That boundary is close. It requires getting used to, not just as a captain, but as a fielder as well. To be aware of the fact that once the ball goes past a 30-yard circle, there's very little distance to cover. You can be misled into thinking that there's a bit of distance to, for the ball to cover. Still, there isn't here in uh, Eden Park. <laughs> this could be close. The qu I think he's waiting because they're running a second. There it is. Smacked hard. That ball was traveling like greased lightning. Now a man coming under it. The catch is taken. This was what India wanted. Confusion to Kiyas and this could be out. The question yes. is asked and he has given him. Just watch where Srinath is. This is the most interesting part. But so, of course, was McCullum. So down the path of goodbye was he. That he had no time to come back. He's out for a duck without facing a ball. Now Srinath's gone up straight away. And the batsman's gone out straight away. He... Bowled him. That's the end of Andre Adams. Danger man is removed. Well, bowls out Khan. Andre Adams out for two, 144 for eight. It's a little uppish. Little up oh, problem now. Must be out. And one will have to question Daryl Tuffy's wisdom in trying to go for a non existent run. Firstly, he has played the ball up in the air. And he's gone. Very good take that by Rahul Dravid. Not an easy take. See, he's got to take it away from the stumps and then get it there. And he did the right thing. It towards the bales. And there it is. It says out. The third umpire signaling Daryl Tuffy. It's gone airborne and it's gone for four. There's a very good stroke from Shane Bond. It brings the 150 up. 151 for nine. Good stuff. Zahir. Now, this might well go. It's gone. Now, this is an expensive over for India. He's off the top of the handle. For a greater reach. And this is a lovely blow. It will go all the way into the stands. Well, Shane Bond saying that if Lou Vincent, you're not going to get on to the striker's end. It's going to be me who's going to do the striking. And what a strike. What a blow. Clean and straight. 176 for nine. Sting in the tail for New Zealand. Oh, it's gone through for four. 18 off the over. It is 180 for nine. Just over of the innings. New Zealand 180 for nine. Vincent. Vincent. High and handsome. And over the head of Zayar Khan. It's not going for four, though. Vincent with two runs. He's on 46. Five balls to go. Shot. Very good shot. 
It is six runs. Hand clapping and chanting. Bond on 23. It's a big one again. That is a big one. Straight it goes again. It's another maximum. Up they go, Billy Bowden. It's 50 partnership. 199 for nine. And that is the end of New Zealand's innings. New Zealand with 53 from Lou Vincent, 53 not out, 42 from Scott Styrus, a couple of starts, Fleming and Sinclair, 14 and 18, 31 from Shane Bond, outstanding, 10 overs, 3 for 13, Zayar Khan was made to pay in the end, 1 for 53 and 10, 1 for 31 from Ashish Nera, and 1 for 34 from Ajit Agarka. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. That is not very good. It's a great shot. That is a really great shot, and it is speeding away for four. Slapped away by Ganguly. That's better from the captain. And he feel better for that. It's gone over the slips. That's gone for four. Short, far too short for the keeper as well, and it's gone. Shot, that is vintage Ganguly, has the touch returned. Great shot, now how fortune turns, away from his body he went through with the shot and it came good this time, a massive helping of kick. And a, what a good shot that is, even better than the previous one. This is the start of Ganguly we know and love watching. More runs. Oh, good stroke. This is one of the best shots of the innings. Off the hip and punched. Big time. Yeah, this time he's got an inside edge. It, there was absolutely no need for the shot because India were going along nicely, his feet going nowhere. He was looking to blast it through the offside. So New Zealand get the breakthrough, India 70 for one. Put down. Chris Harris, who uh, picked up a blob earlier in the day, has put one down here because uh, he had time on his hands. wide of the slips but Sehwag when he hits the ball he hits, hits it over the slips and so the third man really has very little chance particularly in on a ground which is shaped like this now they've all gone up Carl Mills has gone the entire length of the pitch now Sehwag gets the single that brings him a half century doesn't allow him to play the on drive. But he can play shots like that. And this will go all the way. This is going for four. Oh, the dive was a desperate attempt. Here's Mills. Shot. Royal Dravid plays that so well. It's crawling its way, but it's four. Shot. Little loser was all that Sevag needed. Well, he picked the gap. It didn't need to because that's gone all the way. You can have as many fielders as you want inside. If you hit a six, it doesn't matter. I think, I think inside edge on that one was there. He's given him out. He's given him. I don't think Raul Dravid realizes that yet. He's trying to get back in. Well, we'll have a little look on here on Skytrack. Yeah, that looks dead to me. It's pitched just outside off stump. I don't think there was an inside edge. It's hit him right in front of middle stump. Oh, that is a stunning shot. That is the flattest six you will see. He sliced that like it was a birthday cake. He's edged it.
That's taken. Second wicket. He's blazed away through the offside. Another terrific innings. And what a shot to get to that mark. What a great shot that was. Played on the up. He's cutting loose here. Have a look at that. Take that. Gone. Gone this time. Already the damage has been done. India tantalizingly close to victory. Poking at that one. No foot movement. Holds out to Fleming. Virendra Sewa departs after 112. Great applause. For... Oh, yes. Yuvraj has been taken by Fleming at slip. No real cause of worry. 187 for five. Hope you're enjoying our coverage. Oh, that's got to be very close. Oh, yes, it's close enough to be given out. So Banga's stay at the crease is short-lived, and it's because of Andre Adams who traps him. 49 overs. Harris is doing a quite magnificent job, and there's suicide. Suicide has been committed out in the middle. Harris has brought it about, and Agarka is the man who's going. Four balls, three runs. He's bowled him! Adams hits the woodwork. Possibly winning this game. The Indians are making a mess of it. Kev goes for the pull, which was not there. He departs for seven. And the Kiwis can smell the toffee. 197 for eight. Three runs. Oh, it's going to be a wide. That has to... Oh, no! There is absolute pandemonium because Zahir Khan has run the entire length of the pitch. The two Indian batsmen are together, and it's a run out. But oh, here we go. Two balls left, one run required. Ashish Nera. Ashish Nera, you little beauty, you hero for India. And bailed India out of trouble. What a huge sigh of relief for the Indian camp but it certainly has done the Indians a lot of proud smiles it is huge smiles and the noise in here is quite extraordinary in this bowl of Eden Park Auckland India winning by one wicket, they almost didn't. New Zealand made 199 for 9, Vincent 53, Star is 42, then India Sehwag 112. And it really came down to those 49 runs that New Zealand made in the last 